Listen, are you praying for a destiny helper? Are you looking for a destiny helpers in your life? Listen to this. There are three types of destiny helpers. And if you cannot differentiate these three, dif these three destiny helpers in your life, you will serve as a fool um, in the life of one among these three destiny helpers. Number one destiny helper. There is a destiny helper that when they come into your life, they offer you that help that you seek. Mm -hmm. When they come into your life, they pick you up immediately and they take you to that place where you want to be. They don't have time for too many talks. They just come in, they just help you. There is another number two destiny helper. There's this type of destiny helper are the destiny helpers that when you don't ask them for help, even if they have everything you want, they will not give it to you. If you ask them, they will never tell you no. They will give it to you. Once you ask, they will just give it to you. Then number three destiny helper. This one is the dangerous one. And this one is the one that always show up in people's life. Are these destiny helpers. That help that you seek. That help that you desire. They will be doing it like this in your face. They will be tangling the help around your face, but they will never give it to you. These are the types of destiny helpers that will be telling you, Oh, I will help you. Is that what you want? That is nothing for me. Ah, I will do this for you. Ah, don't worry. Ah, I will give you this information. Ah, I will do that. They will keep throwing it around your face, but they will never release it. And remember that the reason that they will keep tangling that help around you and never release it because, because they show you what, they, what you are looking for that is in within their power that they can give it to you. So as a result of that, you will be serving them. You will be running up and down. You will be acting like a fool. You will be playing loyalty. When they say come, you come. When they say go, you go. When they say sit, you sit. When they say jump, you jump. You start tagging me, thinking they're going to drop it for you. Thinking they're going to give it to you. They will never release it. You know why? Because they enjoy your service. So for the fact that they enjoy your service, they know that once they give that thing to you, they will not see that service anymore. So as a result of that, they will keep showing it and keep tangling it around you, but they will never give you that help. So you see, that is why when you are praying and you are asking God to send you destiny helpers, when helpers come into your life, if you see that there is something you need and that they have, just ask them. And if they keep telling you, I will do it, I will do it, and you notice that they keep promising you, but they, they are not giving you that help. Don't try to play smart, trying to be jumping up and down, trying to be running up and down, thinking by so doing, they will give you that help. They will not give you. Just as they say, the person that will help you will not stress you. So when you see destiny helper that want to stress you, that want to use you, before they give you that help, that is not destiny helper. Destiny helpers are people. They don't stress you. They just show up. They just help you. I pray that God send you such a help. A helpers that will just come into your life, take your hand, and walk you into your purpose. May the Lord bless you. Please share this video with friends and family. And God bless you. And leave your comment below.